Hey guys, Ross Tran here. Welcome to another episode of Ross Draws. Chinese New Year's are around the corner, and I thought it's the perfect time to draw Mulan. Yes, my second wife along with Hermione. Ay caramba. It's, uh, it's quite a household. <laughs> yes, Mulan, the apple of my eye, the prime rib of my plate. And she's gorgeous, she's beautiful, and she cooks very well. Mostly Chinese food. But yeah, she could probably really kick my ass. I always wonder what would happen if we would both go to war. Hmm. For honor. You know what, Mulan? I am just tired ah! of your shit. That's right, that's right. You better run, Mulan. War strolls, Mulan! Hey guys, yeah, so this is a sketch I did. Uh, Mulan here is on her horse. I wanted to make her more epic. You know, maybe we'll add a uh, Mushu later. Actually, before we start, uh, I'm kinda hungry. So, uh, let's go get some Chinese food. Brought some Chinese food. No, no, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. There you go. Uh, can I get uh, steam rice? Fried rice, please. Oh yeah, that's good. Can I get orange chicken, please? Orange chicken is the Chinese food essential. Awesome. Thank you so much. Oh, can you say color dodge? Yeah. Color dodge. Color. Color dodge. Color dodge. Yes. Yeah. Welcome back. That was quite delicious. And I got some to go. Took a picture of it, and this is what we came up with. Ah! Chinese food! Awesome! Also, I have a mystery box. Ooh. Place your bets on what might be in here, and we'll use it later in the video. Hey guys, so this is the progress of the piece so far. I think it's looking really cool. What do you think, Frank? Pretty good. Pretty good. We have Mushu over here riding the horse. People always ask me about Horizon Line, and I thought it'd be a great time to put it here. Let's go grab our textbook. I'll be right back. Horizon Line, or eye level, refers to the physical or visual boundary where the sky separates from land or water. The actual height, where your eye sees an object in an interior or exterior scene. Um, actually, this is a book of Cindy Crawford's basic face. Yeah, so I had to memorize that for you guys. So plus one for me. A uh, horizontal line where all the perspective line converge to. Sometimes you just want to take a quick guess where the eye level is and uh, adjust from there. Here? Uh, that doesn't look right yet. It's up here? Nope. Be right here. Brandon says, all right, this is a great spot for horizon line. Not because it hits her, her uh, this area. But it seems like a correct place. See, we can add, uh, little mountains. Maybe my... New dog back here. Ah, spoiler! If you don't know what color to choose for this, just click your gradient on top, die color right here. And then we'll just add a, you know, a layer of pollution because this is uh, also a video to encourage people to stop polluting. Get back on it and I'll check back soon. So at the beginning of the video, I asked you to take a guess on what might be in this Chinese takeout box. Let my roommate take a guess. Roommate number one. Whoa. <laughs> They're useful. Now, roommate number two. <laughs> and my cousin. Whoa. Oh my god. Okay, well, it is egg rolls. Egg rolls. You were right. I meant to say. I tried to use egg rolls inside my painting somehow, and trust me, I know how to use a chopstick, but we ran out. A fork and let's. Feed Mushu some egg roll. Let's see what happened. Mushu, open up. Egg roll time. <gasps> Whoa! Mushu grew! Yes, that's what happened when you feed authentic Chinese food. Woohoo! PF Chang's love that place. Chang is Panda Express! So, for those who guess egg rolls, you guys are exactly right. I am going to uh, continue this and check my soon. Four degree break.
so this is Milo. Milo say hi world. Hi world. Doge. So if you're interested in the extended video tutorial, I'll talk more about movement, shape dynamics, illustrating a scene. So if you're interested in that, come check out our Patreon. And the print winner is Mr. Jet. Yes, congratulations. Ah, biting me. Jet, save me. <laughs> this episode's question is, what's the best gift you've ever gotten? This is seriously one of the greatest things that ever happened to me. What's the best gift you've ever gotten? Please leave a comment below and we'll choose a lucky subscriber. If you like something you see, please subscribe, have a great shiny new year, and we'll see you next time. Ah, you dropped it. You dropped the red envelope. There could be food in here. Oh, wow, look. It's nothing. Bye. <laughs>